Yeah, absolutely. And and for me, it's funny you were talking about handiness and you have to be handy. Uh, my my late father was not handy. He used to bring people in to hang pictures um, in the house. <laughs> so it was it, he just wasn't handy at all. And and I think you're on the other end of the spectrum. As soon as you said get on the roof, I was like, oh my god, I'm not getting on the roof. But but for me. Yeah, for me, I think I split the middle in handiness. Um, so for me, I have the tools. Um, I remember, you know, uh, cars is another thing. I don't know if you want to include cars in here, but uh, God God bless my brother. He's helped me and my family with cars for forever, right? Um, and so I remember one time uh, I called him and I said, you know, uh, my wife's car wasn't starting you know, I, I read him the symptoms. He said it was the battery. Sure enough, it was the battery. He came over with the battery and tried to put it in. And I had like no tools right, to do the battery change, like sockets and wrenches and stuff like that. So he was using pliers or whatever. He got it on, right? But that upcoming birthday, um, I got a box he gave me for my, for my birthday and it, and it was very heavy. And it was a full 120 piece socket and wrench set from Craftsman. And that thing is killer. And I use it all the time. So I think the word that comes into mind when it comes to good tools is repeatability. You wind up using these things all the time. So for me, I have to admit, I am a tool person. Like if I need a certain tool for something, I will go buy it. I don't want to borrow it. I want to buy it because I want to have it because I think eventually I'm going to need it once again. So I have a really good set of tools. And once in a while, I'll go to Home Depot and I'll go there for garbage bags and I'll wind up, wind up walking out with uh, vice grips, which is a true story. Um, it just happens, right? So for me, um, I have built this nice set of tools that, and I've helped out friends and family where I bring my toolbox over and I have the tool for the job. And I just like having them. And once again, I maintain those tools, whether it's a hand tool or a power tool, I really maintain it. But for me, I sit in the middle of the spectrum. Um, so there are certain things I will attempt to do myself and other things I just don't do. Uh, my wife is the same way. Believe it or not, my wife is a really good painter. Like she has no problem tackling painting jobs, which I think was amazing. And so is my son. I really do have to put my 16-year-old to work a little bit more. But um, but it is funny how um, some of us are very handy while others are not. My father was not handy at all. So, But I think the more handy you are, the cheaper it will be to own your home. I think that's what comes into play. So.